Royal editor Russell Myers is back. And Russell, Christian Horner, who of course is married to Jerry from yes. the Space Girls, um, he's been getting a, a little bit of sort of royal support. Yes, I think so. Kind I mean, of. yeah, uh, it was a Bahrain Grand Prix, the season opener. Yeah. Uh, Christian has been involved in a, a bit of a scandal, a bit of uh -huh. a storm over the last few weeks. He's yeah. uh, alleged sending flirtatious alleged messages, um, which were then leaked after he was cleared by uh, by Red Bull. He is, the, of course, the team principal of the F1 team. And, uh, you know, it was obviously who's who at the season opener for the F1. Right. But, um, you know, Duchess of York, Sarah Ferguson was there. Great news for her. She's been told just recently that she's uh, sort of cancer-free after Good. her secondary skin cancer. Good. So, you know, all our support Good for news. Sarah. But she was supporting um, Christian on the track. And uh, Zara Tindall and Mike Tindall were there as well. So a bit of royal support. Interesting um, to see where this one goes yeah. for, you know, the F1 boss. But uh, interesting, again, the sort of people who sure. we're uh, mixing with as well. And, and Jerry has been supporting him as well. So yeah. we wish her all the best, actually. We really do. Um, now, Queen Camilla, mm. she is taking a break. Yeah, she What's is. What's she doing? I mean, listen. What's going on? She has been absolutely flat out. She's not sort of Princess Anne levels relentless, is she? No, but nobody is. She is Thanks. 76 years old. She's Thanks. been the pretty front and centre, the, the leading royal, if you will, over the last few weeks after the Princess of Wales is out of action. The king is out of action having his cancer treatment and, can, and, uh, and Camilla has been leading from the front. So she is going to take a few days R&R. &R. She's jetted off to a sunshine paradise, bit of a wellness retreat, I'm hey. told. But Ooh, she but will be back. Or with pals. Well, do you know what? This, around this time of year, yeah, she yeah. does normally go to a bit of a, a, a retreat, normally in India or somewhere right. like, like Goa. But she's, uh, she's taken herself off, bit of sunshine. She'll be back next Monday, because it's Commonwealth Day next Monday, oh, which a is a one. big... Big, Big deal for the royal family. Sure. And, of course, the king won't be there again. He's going to release a video message. Mm. So she will be the senior royal again. It's quite a remarkable shift Isn't it? that Camilla has had. It's, but she is who would have definitely thought front it? and centre. Well, at least of all her, I thought think. It? I know it's, it, it, is quite, it is quite strange in mm. a way. Um, but, yeah, everybody's going to have to step up, aren't they? Other royals are going to have to do their bit. Ones that maybe are beavering away under the radar might have to... Well, certainly. I mean, Prince William is going to come back to work sure. essentially this week. We've, uh, we saw him a little bit last week, mm -hmm. but he did have to pull out of, uh, of this memorial service for King Constantine. All the major royals uh, attended last week. We spoke about it. Prince Andrew sort of t tottering up yeah, to the front. Yeah, that was weird. It right? was a little strange. Really weird. But, you know, Prince, uh, Prince William's going to be back. Princess Anne is, of course, at work relentlessly throughout the year. She can't do any more. She can't, can't do, do any more. more. Can't do any There's wrong. not enough days in the week. There are. I mean, if anyone needs a sunshine retreat, it's probably <laughs> Anne, to be honest. <laughs> she would just go stop and nonsense. <laughs> exactly. I'm She'd not going to that her wellies on out in the fields. <laughs> but um, there are going to be... There is a, a few gaps looking yeah. around the place, isn't there? You yeah. know, the slimmed-down monarchy's looking a little bit threadbare. I suppose Edward and Sophie need to do a wee bit more, Edward perhaps. Edward and Sophie, we haven't really seen too much of them at the moment. I mean, Edward was out... Um, in St Helena and doing some, some business with uh, the Duke of Edinburgh War, but okay. we haven't seen a no. lot of them. So maybe they do need to step maybe. up, bringing the cavalry, as they say. No, that's true. And of course, everybody asking about Kate because people, I think, I yeah. don't think it's nosiness necessarily. There's maybe a little bit of that, but I think people are genuinely concerned. Because I think so. There's yeah. Huge affection for this young woman. Huge affection for her, of course. And people are just worried about her. I yeah. Guess. I mean, listen. If I had a penny for every time somebody has texted me or asked me or stopped me in the street and asking what is going on with sure. Kate, and so. The things I will say is that, you know, Kate deserves uh, to have her privacy respected course, in yeah. this sense, and mm. I think that everybody can agree with that. She had gone into hospital. It was a planned operation. She had two weeks in hospital. Kensington Palace have always said, once she returns home, she is not going to be in, uh, in action. She's not going to see her on any royal engagement right. until after Easter. Now, where does that put us, really? That puts us into April. So right. we've still got a few weeks to go. So. Mm. The social media rumour, uh, Mill, oh, goes gone crazy. crazy. I mean, and really I horrible, nasty things. It is, and, things. It, and people do see things. You know, the people are not immune to criticism or things yeah. written about them so on the internet. A break, right? I think so. I think you know, everyone needs to calm down a little bit. Mm. It's a medical matter. Very, very different to the king. He was want, willing to speak about his prostate, willing to speak about his cancer mm -hmm. diagnosis, willing to you know drive in the car and um, meet the prime minister and be videoed doing that. 
she's having a very, very different uh, experience. And I would just say yeah. that, um, you know, she's... she's just hope she she's OK. ...rest and recovery. Yeah, I hope she's all right. That's, that's the thing. I think that's I think all people want. I what the palace did say is she's continuing to recover well, and that's good news. Good. As long as that's happening, yeah. then that's absolutely fine. And as you say, cut her a bit of slack, especially on exactly. social media. Stop seeing all these horrible, exactly. nasty, vile things. It's not, it's not helpful at all. Um, you mentioned Charles, we mentioned yeah. Camilla. Uh, they, we know that in October... They're going to be in Australia. Yes, well, hopefully, I mean, you know, I, yeah. I, I will get on the plane as well because this is a long time coming. Um, this book fourth definitely wanted, uh, well, he has wanted to get out into the wider Commonwealth, shall we mm -hmm. say. And um, you know, his trip to Canada has been cancelled this year, under, still undergoing treatment. And Australia may coincide with the uh, Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting, which is in Samoa, which is in October. So, fingers crossed. Charles will right. be well and will be on the so. plane out. I hope so, because they can go to that and then go exactly. to Australia. Over, yeah. and, uh, and you'll be there too. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, <laughs> absolutely. Thank you so, so much. Thanks.